Have you ever pondered the intricate process of detecting ESBL bacteria? It's a fascinating journey involving the clever use of certain drugs known as beta-lactamase inhibitors. These drugs play a crucial role in the detection and understanding of ESBL bacteria, which in turn, assists in the advancement of medical science. Diving right into it, ESBL, or Extended Spectrum Beta-Lactamase Bacteria, are a group of microorganisms that produce an enzyme called beta-lactamase. This enzyme has the ability to break down commonly used antibiotics, making the bacteria resistant to them. This poses a significant challenge in the medical field, making the detection of these bacteria incredibly important. Now, how exactly do we detect these crafty bacteria? The answer lies in the use of beta-lactamase inhibitor drugs. These drugs work by inhibiting the action of the beta-lactamase enzyme, preventing it from breaking down the antibiotics. This allows the antibiotics to effectively kill the bacteria, indicating the presence of ESBL. The process begins with a sample suspected of containing ESBL bacteria. This sample is then exposed to a combination of an antibiotic and a beta-lactamase inhibitor. If the bacteria in the sample are indeed ESBL, they will be unable to break down the antibiotic due to the inhibitor resulting in their demise. This reaction confirms the presence of ESBL bacteria. However, if the bacteria continue to thrive despite the presence of the antibiotic and inhibitor, it indicates that they are not ESBL. This is because non-ESBL bacteria can resist the antibiotic without needing to produce beta-lactamase. By using beta-lactamase inhibitor drugs, we can trick the bacteria into, into revealing their identity. If they fall prey to the antibiotic, they are ESBL. If they survive, they are not.